here we are carving now from polystyrene two large figures standing about three and a half meters tall each um, this is an angel it's taken about two weeks to get this far um, we're creating them for a company called H&H &H Sculptors and they're going out um, to an exhibition in Spain very nice pieces to carve a bit peculiar as well uh, we've been given these little models uh, here which they wanted a, a, an accurate representation of um, including the colours and and all the little sort of uh, finicky little bits which are on it um, not how I'd normally carve it but they've given us a model so we'll try and copy it as true as we can uh, nice things to carve though enjoying it been working late we been working all day go home and have tea and then we come back in the evening and work until one or two in the morning this is the second figure we're carving and here it is beginning to get blocked out and there's a bit of a cubist form at the moment but that's how we kind of look at it um, and then we take off the rough edges later on we wanted to get one almost sort of there apart from the, the finer detail like on its wings and its face uh, which we probably model up in clay um, but yeah uh, tonight though uh, our project is to get the blocking out done at the arms and start to actually tuck into this one now um, now there's no phone calls I can get on with it off an evening Here I am, come back in the evening, I'm checking the model once again and I've had about two or three hours where I've, I'm just starting to work on with the hot wire and wire brushes and, and take it back a little bit and I'm working it all the way around the whole figure so I sort of keep a check on it as I go. All looking a bit sort of lumpy and large at the moment but it will, it will come down and it will eventually take shape. Starting to work on it. We're trying to fill all the seam lines up and down here and around the top and, and all the way down here. I don't know if you can see it uh, in the, along the neck. We have an expert painter called Duncan Bayliss. He comes in and does all our scenic painting. Absolutely fantastic. Thank you, Duncan.